Hey guys and welcome to Versus Scale. So I have a love-hate relationship with OSI keywords and entities. And I think they are going in the wrong direction with people overstuffing their articles and over-optimizing articles. And I've had a lot of success with just uh, plain articles without any extra optimization, so to speak. Having said that, uh, as of now, 2024... Eversize and entities still do work. And when I checked New Writer, I found out that there's been a few updates, mainly the auto insert feature. So I decided to show a very simple and quick workflow using New Writer and SEO writing to get a long form, highly optimized SEO copy. And we'll start with a keyword, which is Can Jasper AI Pass AI Detection? That's the keyword. And since New Writer is extracting not only entities, but also outlines from the SERPs, and it's quite good at it, I decided to first generate an outline with Neuron Writer. And Neuron Writer has a lifetime deal, still on AppSumo. I'm not advertising Neuron Writer, just saying. So let's just go generate outline. And I'm using Medium Creativity and GPT-4 Turbo. I feel like this gives me the best results. Uh, let's head over to SEO Writing. And I don't like how H1 is not my keyword, so let me just correct that real quick. Okay, so I'll be using a one-click mode. Let's generate a title. I think for this article, so it seems like the optimal length is under 1,000 words. So what I'll do, I'll probably go for small, like so. I'll be using GPT for 128K Turbo. Point of view... I, me, target country, United States. Details to include. I showed it in my previous videos that you can actually include some of the links. So include links to the AI. And just a sprinkle of other links, like so. Maybe to my lead magnet as well. Let's try that. Yep. So number of images, three. Image style cinematic. YouTube videos, one. Distribute evenly. Okay, SEO. So for the SEO, we need to copy the terms from your writer and do this here. And I'll be using basic and extended, excluding the header terms. Okay, now for the introduction, let's go for one of my EEAT prompts. Include the author, Vlad Ivanov, the owner for the scale. Mention he has been an authority on AI detection, blah, blah, blah. I do not want FAQs. Everything else is fine. And if you like this setup, you can save it as a template, which is very handy. Now for the outline editor. This is a, a hack that I found. It's not a hack actually, but it's a workaround. So you copy the outline to Excel and you just get rid of these blank cells. Okay. And now you just need to insert a number, so the largest text will be 1, well, the smaller text will be 2, and even smaller text will be 3, so this is easy. You don't have to cross-reference it with New Writer each and every time. You just go by the size of the font, so like so. Just copy this here, go back to SEO Writer, and you just paste it like so. And so this works like magic. So I won't be using my personal key, nor will I be publishing this. Even though I can, I connect to web, obviously, I need to say yes to that, real-time search results, and everything else seems to be working fine. For the details to include, I'll click on intense mode, which means that I want to include these links in each section, and I can always delete them from the output later, so let's hit run. Okay, our article is ready, it only took two minutes or so, I just copy everything, head back to new writer, and my title and meta description are pre-populated, that's why the score is 17, and not zero. Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> and the score is 81. So the, the competitor's best is 77, and we are 81. And prior to that, I would go uh, to FAQs, unused uh, terms, and then just try to stuff the FAQs with OSI keywords, and that, that never worked. And then, of course, Google said that we don't care about FAQs if you're not a high-authority website. So now what you can do, if you want to make this even better, you go to auto-insert. And then you get the suggestions, uh, which you can proofread and accept if they are okay. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight... 9, 10, 11, K11 11 suggestions. And our score shot up from 81 to 82. <laughs> I'm joking, of course, but this is because we were already very high up in the SEO score. 
So usually that uh, auto insert I can get uh, easily plus 20 SEO scores. So if you're like in low 60s, you can easily get up to 75, 77 by doing that. Also, let's check how my EAT prompt works. So this is the beginning of the article and this is the intro. Hello there, I'm Vlad Ivanov and I've carved a niche for myself as an authority on AI detection with my channel words at scale. Curiosity led me to conduct a little experiment. Can Jasper AI, renowned for revolutionizing content creation, really pass AI detection? So this is uh, basically how you can introduce EAT with a simple prompt and using SEO writing. And I can see that none of my links have been added. This may have something to do with the way I prompted them. So I did not say add them as a rich anchor text. So, so that might be a problem. And I actually advise you to go to back to my older video, which is called SEOwriting.ai Images, Hacks and Tricks. And there I show you how I use the internal links with SEO writing. But SEO writing is about to actually uh, launch internal links and external links. I don't have an ETA yet, but I'm hoping that's going to be by the end of this month or beginning of the next. And while you're at it, go check out Vas Universe, uh, where we have exclusive uh, discounts for our, our members, like 30% off SEO writing, the highest discount code that exists right now on the internet, and also my Niche Hunter course, which is 30 ways of finding portfolio niches. And we all know that the first step, considerably the most important one, is finding the right niche. So this is a industry-first course dedicated to finding portfolio niches. That's it. Hope you found this video helpful. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys. And I'll see you next time.